Good morning, day eight, maybe nine. Don't know what happened yesterday afternoon. I was trying to do a, a closing session outside this, our guest house of Claire Var, which was absolutely fantastic. Um, so we got here about three or four o'clock in the afternoon after a 7.6 miler, a little short one, and we've got a nine mile today. That place there was absolutely brilliant. Um, yesterday, Woodlands, uh, um, bit of road work, walking, oh, you'll see it anyway. But yeah, a great little spot. Looking forward to today, but the cafe is shut, damn it. Huh, maybe we're gonna have some breakfast, but it's not quite open. Morning. So, um, about half past eight now few pair of gringos on the path already ready um, as you say it's raining again I don't know what's happening with the cafe I thought it was open anyway let's see how we get on are we ready where's the cafe why come the cafe so please oh come on <laughs> well the cafe might not be open but the bin men are still working and as you can see, it's raining. Julie's weather forecast that she looked at was 90% chance of rain. Mine was 50. Okay. I can't see myself doing a lot of filming today because it's not nice. Apparently, there's um, there's two two different routes to take coming out of um, a small village we've just been in. Um, one is to the left, one is to the right. Um, this one's just showing to the left at the moment, um, but I'm sure there's going to be another path somewhere along the line. Lovely little bench over there, but just not the weather for sitting down. Both our feet, or both our feet, <laughs> both sets of feet are soaking wet already. We've been walking for literally not even 10 minutes. So, uh, maybe new walking shoes when we get back. Left or right? We're going left. A complimentary. That's what it says. Com complimentary um, trail. It's free, you know. <laughs> it's free. <laughs> I think it's about a kilometre longer. The guy said the other one went through an industrial estate. Um, so we just have to see.
could be open. We haven't had any breakfast. We are starving. Well, I am. I could eat a horse and a jockey. <laughs> All in one. Great big sandwich. <laughs> at last, a bar and playing welcoming music. Well, that was a welcome break. <clears throat> we needed that. The, um, I think it's like a football club. I'm not sure. But it was absolutely packed with uh, peregringos. Um, people coming in all the time when we were there. So, yeah, all good. Nice bacon baguette and a cheese baguette. Two coffees. Coca-Cola. A lot. Today. She's cold, but you've had some nice Coca Cola. Yep. And a cheese and a bacon baguette. So we're ready to rumble now. Yep. Bring on the Camino. Actually, we're um, 3.9 miles in. quick respite from the rain under this motorway bridge near the cars above Julie's steaming ahead look at her wait for me You don't see any uh, peregrinos for miles and miles. And then, all of a sudden, it's like when you're waiting for a bus. All of a sudden, they all turn up at the same time. <laughs> we have come off the path a bit, though. We um, we missed the turn in, going back a couple of. Kilometers. But I think, yeah, but I think everyone else has. It makes no difference. I've had a look at the the map, and it's all going to rejoin in a minute. Maybe even more on the path. <laughs> I've been rather naughty. Well, we've both been naughty because we've come off the official Camino only because we got lost and now we've found it again. But it's brought us through the, um, the shopping centre and it's been a bit more interesting, hasn't it? Yeah. Yeah. We haven't stopped in any bars yet. We haven't stopped in a, in a bar, but I'm sure we'll find one. Thank you. Thank you. Well, we've had 20 long minutes out of the rain. <laughs> and it 20 was 20 not long enough, isn't it? 20 minutes not long enough, you're right. We've had a glass of wine and some um what was like little Quichon French dip. Quichon French dip. <laughs> and um oh lovely. All for four five euros. Five euros. That was great. So, back out in the rain, 
looking for the Camino again. We've got about an hour and a half walk to our next accommodation. Fingers crossed. Okay. Hey, stop raining. Ooh. <laughs> Started raining again, never mind. Hundred and one now. Hundred and one. Oh look. Hundred and one. We'll soon be on the hundred. Once you're down to a hundred apparently, you've got to get two stamps a day. We can draw our own. Yeah, I'm gonna make one up. Six men. Okay, we've seen one of those in the, um, oh, guest house pension yesterday. Wondered what it was. And we found out it's for storing grain, isn't it? Mm -hmm. We thought it was a tomb. <laughs> yeah, the only problem with that is if it's a family tomb, then every time you move house, you have to take it with you. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, but they yeah. looked a bit, some of them were bigger than that. They did look like, um, to me, very <laughs> to me. Okay, we are, oh, where are we? A Moss. place called Moss, M-O-S. Uh, we're still on the Camino. Uh, we've got a branch off of it now, up this road, I believe. And then we've got to start looking for an apartment we booked, which is a bit over budget, but the only option was a um, on a burge and a bunk bed, and I didn't fancy get, getting on the top bunk, so that's it. So we're up here somewhere. It always takes the last bit. Always seems to take the longest. Anyway, wrapping things up. How was the How was the day been? Oh, started off wet. We came out the front door and it was just a hammering down. Yeah. Um, and I guess for the last, what time is it now? So that was nine o'clock and it's quarter to three. I suppose it's been like full time rain with a few little gaps in between. Yeah. But it's... also, um, really cold when it's raining. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's warmed up now, but it felt mm. freezing when we stopped at that football club place for that, um, bacon bat. That was, what time was that? About 11? Yeah so cold um freeze your cobs off it would freeze your bread cobs off but um it has warmed up a bit but it's been i'd say weather wise it has been a bit miserable but um oh, <laughs> but hopefully tomorrow will be a little bit brighter you've got a bad leg oh a little dog ran past um tomorrow will be a bit brighter um and should be yeah we'll just we'll just plod on and we've um Bonus. come under the 100k we are now under the 100k um, to finishing point yeah so we've got to start looking for double stamp days <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> all right we're gonna wrap it in now and we might show you around the apartment if it's any good if it's not we won't bother I don't know if you can see it, but I think this has been the steepest hill <laughs> that we've walked in the eight, nine days we've done the Camino. And it's just going up to, um, up to our apartment. The Camino's back down the hill. Oh God, we've started it now. Oh, 
Christ, it is. <laughs> <laughs> Well, having put our trust in Google Maps yet again and getting lost yet again, we eventually found our accommodation. If only we'd have stayed on the Camino, we'd have walked straight past the front door. Never mind, after having a nice hot shower and sorting some stuff out, we ventured back down into the village of Moss for a lovely meal and a couple of well-earned glasses of wine. Okay, catch you tomorrow. Bye.